Hello, I'm Bernard Hickey from interest.co.nz and welcome to 90 at 9, brought to you in association with the Bank of New Zealand. This is your morning briefing where you get everything you need to know in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock, starting now with news that European stock markets rose 4% overnight. This was after European finance ministers met in Luxembourg and agreed on ways to examine bolstering bank balance sheets. Now, this is a key element in any fix for the European debt crisis. There needs to be restructuring of bank balance sheets, there needs to be a bigger bond buying fund, and the European Central Bank needs to lower interest rates. This follows the slump in the Belgian bank, Dexia, over the last couple of days. The Belgian government was forced to pledge that it would back Dexia. It's been hit hard by Greek losses and also a delay in the Greek bailout. The market shrugged off Italy's credit rating downgrade of three notches by Moody's. However, this just follows cuts by Standard & Poor's. Italy has really slow growth, which is making it difficult to repay its debts. US stocks were up 1% in late trade. Remember though, it can be quite volatile in that last hour of trade. Oil prices were up around 2%. Brent crude over $100 a barrel again. And there was some mildly good news from the US economy, where the services sector showed some growth in September. The ISM, Institute of Supply Management Survey, showed the economy still expanding, and we saw some mild improvement there. I'm Bernard Hickey. That was 90 at 9, brought to you in association with Bank of New Zealand.